Don Dale eases them up to the starting gate, and here they come. The Hamiltonian field on its way. They're off and trotting, captain's boy out very fast, choir boy on the inside, Flawless driving for that lead on the outside, and Cheer Honey moving right along with him. That is Flawless going to the front, Cheer Honey up on the outside, captain's boy is third, B.F. Coltown fourth, choir boy fifth, Speedy Scott sixth, Glidden Hanover is seventh, Elma eighth round the turn, Star Act is ninth, Careless Hanover tenth, Buff Hanover is eleventh, Digsdale twelfth, Dorado thirteenth, and Filter fourteenth as they fly to that quarter mile mark. Leading the way, it is Floorless by half a length, and Floorless goes to the quarter mile mark in 28 seconds. B.F. Coltown is moving up now as they head to the backstretch. That's Floorless with the lead. Cheer Honey is second, Captain's Boy third, and there goes Speedy Scott out of sixth, and B.F. Coltown moves right along with him. Heading down the long backstretch at DuCoin, Floorless leads by two lengths. Here comes B.F. Coltown, thundering up on the outside. He is second now, and Speedy Scott is moving right along in his third on the outside. As they come to the half mile mark, that is B.F. Coltown getting the lead by three quarters of a length. That's the half in 58 seconds flat. Speedy Scott moves up on the outside to be second now. In third is Flawless along the rail and Cheer Honey is fourth. Speedy Scott powering up on the outside takes the lead to the far turn. It is Speedy Scott leading the way by a length and a half. B.F. Coltown is second, Flawless third, Cheer Honey fourth, Glidden Hanover is fifth, Captain's Boy sixth. Elma seventh as they round the turn, and Choir Boy is eighth. Digsdale ninth, Buff Hanover tenth, Star Act eleventh, Careless Hanover twelfth, Dorado thirteenth, and Filder trails the field. Ralph Baldwin has Speedy Scott in front by two. B.F. Coltown is second, turning for home, and Flawless is out of third and driving now. But it is Speedy Scott, the one to catch at the head of the stretch. Speedy Scott trotting powerfully. Flawless is driving on the outside. It is Speedy Scott by a length. Flawless is coming on and collars Speedy Scott. It's Flawless on the outside, Speedy Scott on the inside, and a driving finish. Flawless getting up to win the first heat of the Hamiltonian by a head. One fifty-seven and three-fifths. A new world record for three-year-old trotters by Flawless, the powerful son of Florican. Owned by the Arden Homestead Stable of Goshen, New York, Flawless chopped almost a full second off Caleb's old world race mark as he beats Speedy Scott by a head. Again, Harry Panall has shown his magic touch with Young Trotter. Forless's price of victory is the saliva test. Speedy Scott was also timed in 157 and 3 fifths in that first world record heat. And now, Flawless and Speedy will be one, two at the rail. But anything can happen in a horse race like the Hamiltonian, and all 12 of the other entries are coming back for more. Second heat of the Hamiltonian. Here they come. They're off and trotting, Star Act fifth in the first heat, races for the lead from the outside with Flawless out fast on the inside. That is Starak, Flawless, B.F. Coltown moving up fast on the outside, and moving right along with him is Choir Boy as they go into the first turn. Starak has the lead after an eighth of a mile, Flawless second, Choir Boy between horses trotting very fast up to second now, and B.F. Coltown on the outside is third as they go to the quarter mile mark. Going for that lead is Choir Boy. Starak is on the inside at the quarter in 28 and 2 fifths seconds. It is Choir Boy, Starak, B.F. Coltown is third, Flawless fourth, Speedy Scott trotting fifth, Cheer Honey is sixth, Captain's Boy seventh, Elma is eighth, Glidden Hanover ninth, Filder tenth, Dorado eleventh, Careless Hanover twelfth, Buff Hanover is thirteenth, and Diggs Dell is fourteenth as they go down the backstretch. B.F. Coltown flying now is driving up the challenge, Choir Boy for the lead. It is B.F. Coltown on the move, and Flawless is on the move also. Flawless drives powerfully up the half, they're there in 58 and 3 fifths seconds. And it is Flawless coming on after the lead, taking over from B.F. Coltown. And here comes Speedy Scott, moving right after Flawless as they swing round the far turn. That is Flawless leading now by three quarters of a length. Speedy Scott up on the outside. B.F. Coltown is third. Choir Boy trotting fourth. Star Act is fifth. Cheer Honey sixth. Elma seventh. Glidden Hanover is eighth. Filder ninth. Crapton's Boy tenth. Dorado is eleventh. Careless Hanover, Buff Hanover, and Diggs Dell. And it's the big two. Flawless on the inside. Speedy Scott on the outside. 
matching strides, head and head, neck and neck, nose and nose, turning into that stretch. Speedy Scott on the outside, Flawless on the inside. Harness Racing's two greatest three-year-olds battling it out in the second heat of the Hamiltonian. Speedy Scott on the outside forges up now to lead by a head, Flawless under a heavy drive on the inside. And Speedy Scott is drawing out in the second heat. It's Speedy Scott by three quarters of a length over Flawless. Speedy Scott and Ralph Baldwin, not to be denied by even the world record-breaking Flawless that time, the property of Castleton Farm, Speedy Scott, a son of Speedster, is a really colorful character who trots most of the time with his tongue dangling out the side of his mouth. And now, while the Hamiltonian battlers relax for a while, the world's fastest trotting stallion, Mattastar, sets out to beat the Ducoin track record of 1 minute 57 and 1 fifth seconds. And Harry Pinal is in for still another fast ride. Mattastar hits the three quarters in the incredible time of 1.25, and another track record is going, going, gone. Mattastar in one minute, 56 and two-fifth seconds. In behind the gate for the big third heat. Here they come. They're off and trotting, flawless out fast on the inside, captain's boy from the outside, Speedy Scott along the rail, and on the extreme outside, B.F. Coltown as they head into that first turn. That is flawless with the lead, but captain's boy is right there to challenge. B.F. Coltown moves up now to be third after the first eighth of a mile, and Speedy Scott saves ground along the rail in fourth as they go to the back stretch. Flawless has the lead by a neck. On the outside is Captain's Boy. B.F. Coltown moves up now to be third. And Speedy Scott is fourth past the quarter in 28 and 3 fifths seconds. Flawless has the lead. Captain's Boy moves up. Speedy Scott is third. B.F. Coltown out of fourth. Elma fifth on the outside. Buff Hanover sixth. Star Act is seventh. Filter is eighth. Dorado ninth. Glidden Hanover tenth. And Choir Boy is 11th as they race down the back stretch going to the half mile mark. Captain's Boy has the lead now by half a lot. But B.F. Coltown, a front racing factor in all three heats, is up one second for the lead at the half in 57 and 3 fifths seconds. B.F. Coltown takes that lead for Carl Larson by a length. Captain's Boy is second. Here comes Flawless up on the outside in third, and Speedy Scott is right behind him in fourth. Elma fifth. Buff Hanover is sixth. Glidden Hanover seventh on the outside, moving up. Dorado is eighth. Choir Boy trotting ninth. Filter is tenth. Star Act is eleventh, and it's B.F. Coltown in front by a length as Flawless makes a determined charge on the outside. Flawless moves up now for Harry Pinal to challenge B.F. Coltown for the lead. It is B.F. Coltown turning for home. They were at the three quarters in one twenty-seven and three fifths. B.F. Coltown at the rail. Flawless coming on for the lead, and Speedy Scott comes three wide in the stretch drive. Flawless now has the lead, but here comes Speedy Scott, and Buff Hanover moves to the inside. It is Flawless under a drive as Speedy Scott races up to get the lead. Speedy Scott going out, Flawless and Buff Hanover, and it's Speedy Scott winning the third heat and the Hamiltonian. The mile in one minute, 58 and two-fifths seconds. Speedy Scott and Ralph Baldwin put the finishing touches on the fastest three-heat battle ever waged. The combined total time knocks four major world records out of the book. Now winner of the first two legs of Trotting's Triple Crown, the Yonkers Futurity and the Hamiltonian, the big bay son of Speedster and Scotch Love, seems destined to go down as one of the great trotting colts of all time. And if Speedy Scott could look ahead, he would also see the Triple Crown, Grand Slam, and the Harness Horse of the Year award in his immediate future. Truly a day when Speedy can stick his tongue out at the rest of the racing world.